Songwriting Challenge 2020. My name is Rod, this is Vito. Uh, today we are going to talk about song form. When we talk about song form, we have various things within songs that make it recognizable to everything, everybody who listens. So when we write a song, typically when I, I say to my students, nobody cares about your perfect life, so if your life is in complete perfection, then usually we don't go writing songs, we just go living our life perfectly. So, um, basically our song, our creation is going to be trying to observe and be a, a, a microphone to uh, various things that happen in life, both uh, both horrible and wonderful at all points in between, but not, not boring. So anyway, so with that said, the verse of the song, the verse of the song is kind of like this is the stuff that changes all the time. We talk about the verse of the song. It is, in, from verse to verse, there's storytelling going on. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, in our story, you have characters, just like any other story. We have characters, we have, we have uh, problems, we have a setting. a setting, we have all the things that you, when you think about writing a normal story, uh, the details of a song, that is, the details of a song, that is, that is what happens in a verse. Uh, so that is the first thing, that is the first thing you have to be aware of. Now, on the other end of things, we have the chorus. The chorus of the song is the part of the song that contains the hook. When I say the hook, what I'm referring to is the part of the song that, when we think of, uh, when we think of a song, um, the most important lyrical line of the song, that would be the hook, the thing that sticks in our, that little earworm that we have. Um, so that's, in most songs that we all listen to, you have a verse and you have a chorus, okay? Now, we have the option of using bridges as well, and oftentimes we use bridges. One of the most important bridges and the one we're gonna use today and we're gonna learn about today is what, um, I call, and others have called, the transitional bridge, which some people refer to as the pre-chorus, but I think of it as a transitional bridge, and what a transitional bridge, it does what a bridge does. It takes you from one place to another. In other words, we have a verse, and we have a chorus, but we need something in between. We need something to carry us from the verse to the chorus. That is what a transitional bridge does. Alrighty, so, in our storyline, we have the details, we have let that, that bit of stuff that takes us to uh, the hook, the part of the song with the hook, all right? Now, in our song, we, we Vito and I have been pondering our story about the 732 war, mm -hmm. and we came up with some other ideas. You can go ahead and, and, and talk about some of the ideas we're talking about. Mm -hmm. 732 could also be an important number. Yes, yeah, so last time we kind of discussed the idea of maybe 732 war being a metaphor for something, right? So as Rod said, usually um, there aren't many songs about everything going well, right? Because like we're drawn to things that we connect to. So in this case, you know, the war being a metaphor for like a relationship ending or some kind of conflict between people, whether it's a house address, 732 something something street, or as Rod said, an apartment. Um, so we kind of try to play with that metaphor and like other terminology of you know, war terminology or relational sort of conflict terminology, and that all sounds really complicated just for the idea of saying we we're trying to be story. colorful with our with our story. We don't want yeah. we don't necessarily want our story to be like uh, like boring. Not boring. Like like as a writer, so Vito is he he is a he is a writer like kind of a writer writer. Okay, so he knows he knows what he's doing with his stuff. So. When we think about writing, we think about metaphors, we think about colorful words, we think about telling a story in a way that doesn't, uh, is not clean, uh, read with uh, cliches. Yeah. So anyway, so our 732 war lines drawn along the wall, a broken lamp on the table, the crooked mirror in the hall. That's the lyric we came up with. And then, uh, and then we have never the surrender to gain a sense of who we are. So that is the bridge. That is the transitional bridge. So we're going to we're going to give it a shot. Sure. Okay. 
So, and this is our, our, our song that we started last Sunday. One. Challenge 2020. We will see you soon. My name is Rod. This is Vito. Bye. See you later.